Now, strange question, but can rehab be fun? That's part of the goal of a new physical therapy program for stroke patients devised by a Korean doctor. The program uses video games to get patients moving again. Jimmy Gill has more. This woman has had a stroke and now she has difficulty moving her arms and legs. As part of a rehabilitation program, she's playing a series of games developed by a doctor at Seoul National University Hospital in Pundang, south of Seoul. With this game, she uses her hands to move blocks from one side of the wall to the other. The activity will help her to overcome the partial paralysis in her hands and fingertips as a result of the stroke. Here, she controls a spaceship with her arms to avoid meteorites, which helps her to regain muscle control and improve her reaction time. The virtual rehabilitation therapy can be easily done at home without the need to visit a hospital. This virtual rehabilitation game is fun and comfortable to use. I can do it by myself when I'm at home. This game is based on the Kinect technology from Microsoft, which can detect a patient's movements and translate them into actions on screen. When a patient suffers a stroke, it is likely that they will have some paralysis in their arms or legs. Using the Kinect camera device, patients can easily undergo rehabilitation by playing games. Stroke patients can also play the virtual rehabilitation games in pairs, which can add to the fun. The games also provide information on the accuracy of a patient's movements and the patient's overall performance. The games will be ready for commercialization within two years. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.